Drink Beats. Welcome back to the channel. I am resuming on cleaning the engine bay today. So I'm going to show you what I'm going to do to get some of the dirt out and see if this remedy that I'm going to use is going to work to help loosen up some of the dirt that I have. And then I went and picked up some pieces and tools to help get rid of some stuff and see if this stuff works and go from there. So with that being said, Let's get into this video and let's get this knocked out. Okay, with that being said, let's get started on my mixture. I'm gonna spray this first. Like I said, this is something I'm trying on my own and I don't know if it's gonna work, but I'm just gonna try to see and go from there and see how good it works to get as much done as possible. I do not have a sandblast or anything like that, so I'm gonna use what I can and get what I done, get, get what I can done with what I have. So with that being said, let's go ahead and um, remove these wires right here. I'm gonna go ahead and remove these wires real quick, move them out of the way. Um, move them out of the way so you know so they're, so they're not in the way of what I'm doing. And we'll go from there. Mood. I'll probably just set you up on like the tripod or whatever that way I can go you know what before I even go ahead and start spraying I will go ahead and try to remove these wires right here but these wires are right there before I start spraying because I, I want to clean right there so let me go ahead and pause real fast and remove those wires and then we'll come back Okay, I'm coming back because before I can remove those wires, I almost fell. Uh, before I can remove those wires, remove those wires, I gotta remove this guy right here. This guy, remove it. Once I get that removed, then we can push the wires through. And after I get done pushing the wires through, then we can start doing the first step that I wanna do. So, one more again, let me pause it real quick and get my other thing, cause I didn't think I was gonna have to have that. So, let me get my other thing set up so we can get that knocked out and then we can continue this video. Now that we got all the now that we got all the wires out of the way, I don't know if I said that, but now that we got all the wires out of the way, that wires out of the way, uh, this piece right here is out the way for now. I did put that up. Uh, yes, I know it has a big hole, but I will be covering it before I do anything. So I am going to go ahead and hmm, spray the engine bay with this real quick and then go back and I'm going to mix this uh, right there if you can see that mix that real quick and then show you what I'm going to do how much I'm going to do and see if this is going to work at the same time I don't know so with that being said I'm going to set you up on my tripod and let you guys see what I'm doing so sorry for all the pausing and stuff like that but at the same time it's just I'm kind of like in a hurry, but I want to give you guys more content on what I'm doing. So I am taking my time and going ahead and recording this so you can see what I'm doing instead of being in the loop on what I'm doing. So therefore, you just hold on real sick, real sick, and I'll resume real short. Okay, here we go, guys. We're going to go ahead and spray this. I know I don't have that much battery on this one, so I don't know how much it's going to, how long it's going to last, but I'm going to go ahead and spray. Don't worry, guys. I did buy more. Now I'm gonna mix this, these two together. Uh, don't know how, how well it's gonna work, but it's gonna mix them together. Okay, 
you saw that. Now I'm gonna add some water to it and then we'll see what it does and we'll spray it on and go from there. So I'm gonna pause it real quick, put some water in it and then go from there. Oh no, wait, I'm gonna show you what water, how much water I put in it. So give me a second. I'm gonna use the faucet outside to put the water in. Uh, hopefully this works, but it got a big mouth. So let's go ahead and put the water in. You at least want to get the bubbles out. Uh, that way it's potent, still stays potent. Okay, that is it on the water. And if you see the mixture, it's still, you know, the uh, soap is still at the bottom of it. So I'm gonna give it a, a shake when I put the lid on. So I'm going to put it right here, right here. Here's the lid, here's the lid right here. Put this down right here so y'all can see. Hopefully you can see this. Put the lid on. Give it a shake. See the, see the, see the detergent? You know, mix, trying to mix. That's what I want. Not saying this is gonna work, but this is something I want to try. Um, and let it sit then come back and redo it. So let's go ahead and try to get this done. Now we're resuming with this spray. I uh, just showed you the mixture on what, how much water and all that I did. Getting it ready, pre-pump it. Go ahead and just spray it. Spray it everywhere you applied the other stuff. Okay, a drive, so we're gonna try to do it one more time with the spray. So do I'm gonna mix me some more of this and then find me a towel or something to, or a towel in a bucket and see if I can wipe some of this out and then go back and rinse it and then go from there. All right, I've zoomed my mixture. If you can see back here, uh, I used a little bit to see if it's gonna work. If you can see back there, I used a little bit to see if it was gonna work. Um, to be honest right now, I'm going to change my clothes and my shoes and get inside the engine bay and get in detail what I'm trying to get. I was just trying to see if the solution that I was using is going to work and you know I did the same solution in the uh, mop bucket or the water bucket or whatever you want to call it the car bucket or whatever it want to be called I did the same solution add the same amount of water uh, and I'm like I said I'm using a towel to get in the crevices of what I can while I can so with that being said I am going to change clothes and um, come in here and wipe it down with the, the water and the mixture that I, that I did in the engine bay and the window seals and stuff like that and then come back and kind of like not really spray it but kind of like give it a mist to get all the dirt off I don't want to get water in the inside right here that I'm looking at right now I don't want to get water too much in the in the in the inside of the car so I want to just like you know spray a light mist or some figure out how to get it off the the water and the soap off of the car without getting it in the inside of my engine bay, I mean inside of my car, in the carpet and stuff like that. And, you know, have to figure out how to clean up the carpet and all that good jazz. But I just wanted to see if it was gonna work. But like I said, I started clean up one side and you can still see the soap scum, uh, the dirt and stuff like from, from, from that. Um, so I'm gonna show you real quick. Uh, if you can see uh, the color of it there and then if you look at the color of it over there you can kind of kind of kind of tell the difference on how it looks there and then compared to there um, and then in the back right there you can tell like I did clean off some of that you can tell that it's a different color that's a dirty 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 gray 
on back there and then it gets a little lighter and then a lighter gray here um, so I'm going to pause this right here and come back after I change my clothes and we'll get this knocked out I am closing out the video on me cleaning out my engine bay with my concoction that I made and hopefully that will help you guys for those that don't have a sandblaster maybe it'll work for you maybe it won't I just did this if it helped me but at the same time you know it helped me get you know the dirt and stuff out and at the same time it got it to where, where I wanted it to be and you know if I had a sandblaster would have did the sandblaster but at the same time guys you know it got it ready to, for me to sand it and get all the other stuff out and then I did do a video on me doing some other things with me cleaning the, cleaning the engine bay and getting the paint out but that's on another video I won't spill too much of that I want to say thank you for watching like subscribe comment share and all that good jazz um, follow me on Facebook Instagram Twitter and Tumblr and if you haven't already go ahead and subscribe hit that subscribe button and if you like this video hit that like button and if you uh, want to or like to or don't feel like it but want to do it anyway go ahead and go ahead and hit that notification bell for all the new upcoming videos and guys thank you for watching I know I close out the video but I do want to say real quick that um, I noticed that I have lost some subscribers and stuff like that guys you can do me a solid if you can uh, unsubscribe and resubscribe and uh, do all that good stuff and hit that notification bell again that way you'll be notified with all the new upcoming videos that I have and sorry about the mishaps but you know I just found out that you know it's been going on for quite a while with YouTube so guys I don't want to take too much more of your time I just wanted to get that out the way just like I said before thank you for watching and we'll see you guys soon.